Hi everyone, this is Mari, and in this video I'm going to show you how I build websites. I use a program called Rapid Weaver version 5, and this is a web design software that's built exclusively for Mac users. So if you're on a Mac and you want to build your own website, I do recommend Rapid Weaver. Um, if you want to hire me to build your website, I'm just telling you that this is the software that I use. It's very easy to use. Uh, I love it and I'm going to show you a few examples of how I've taken the built-in templates and really modified them to create very distinct unique looks. Okay so starting with um, my husband's website which I built I think um, oh almost two years ago now. Um, I used a template that came packaged with Rapid Weaver called the Alpha Theme. Now before I show that to you since I'm here I'll show you that uh, Rapid Weaver comes, as I said, packaged with a lot of different themes, and a lot of them are really good looking themes. So, um, if you're on a Mac and you cannot afford a web designer or you just don't want to go through that, you just want to build it yourself, uh, you can certainly browse through all of the themes that come with the software, input your information, and quickly upload it to the web and get a nice website. I honestly do not recommend doing that however and the reason is is that you're gonna have a website that may look professional but it just kinda of looks like it came out of the package um, and um, I really believe that every website should reflect accurately who you are what you do and um, should really look the way you want it to okay so anyway <laughs> uh, let's see if I had kept this theme the way it was that's how it probably would have ended up looking like and I think I have an example okay I'll show you this in a preview in Firefox okay so if I had left my husband's website you know without changing the template at all would have had this kind of weird background with the stripes this very boring dark gray uh, Wolf wanted something very clean, very easy to look at. He wanted a black background with white text. Um, and he wanted the navigation menu to have some red in it, I think. So he asked for that. That's what I gave him. And here's what I ended up with. Okay, so I took that theme from Rapid Weaver as it was, and I changed it into this. And what I did was I just changed the CSS coding to strip out the background and replace it with this black. Uh, when I was working in Rapid Weaver, I changed uh, the appearance of the navigation menu. Wolf wanted something that was just very easy to navigate and to look at. So every page is very simple, has one picture on it, except for his show reel page, which is probably the most important page on his site. And there we added a QuickTime movie compilation of his work. We made sure that it was um, that it would load very quickly. So I'll give you a quick look. The aim of the game is to feel real good. And these are just clips from a number of films and commercials and documentaries that he's shot over the years. Okay. And um, this, uh, if I remember correctly, this QuickTime movie I just placed onto a regular uh, page in Rapid Weaver. Um, the real work was in configuring the QuickTime movie to load very quickly so that no one has to wait for it, you know, to start. That's very important. Then here's his contact page, and if you notice, on the right-hand side uh, is a sidebar with just his email address and nothing else. He wanted everything to be simple on this site, so that's what he got. Um, I created a flash slideshow uh, of stills from all the films that he shot so that you have something nice to look at while you're jotting down his contact information. So that's an example of how I took one of the themes that's, that comes built in Rapid Weaver and modified it to get a certain look. And I, I'm very proud of this. I think it's exactly what my client, who happened to be my husband, uh, wanted. There he is on location. That's his site. Now, one of the other things that I love, I really love about Rapid Weaver is that, um, like WordPress, 
which I talk about in another video, but like WordPress, there are tons of third-party developers who are creating themes, who are creating graphics, and all sorts of plugins for Rapid Weaver. So you don't have to just use the templates that come built in with Rapid Weaver. You can find other wonderful themes made by other designers and um, modify them with Rapid Weaver, and that's what I do these days. So I recently found this theme. It's called the Create Theme by a company called Elixir Graphics. And the moment I saw it, I just fell in love with it. It's very clean. It's kind of slick. Um, and when I read about all of its features, um, I just thought, I have to have this. And I was in the process of rebuilding and redesigning my own website for um, a hobby that I have called Mischief Mari Cookies. And I thought, this is perfect. So um, just showing you uh, a demo of the theme. And what I liked about it is that you can change the header on every page so that it's different. And that header image can also be a slideshow. So you can make it run automatically or click on it to change the pictures at the top. You can add what's called extra content at the top or the bottom of your page in one, two, three, or four columns. Um, you can add a different sidebar to every page with different content. You can use the theme as a blog itself. It's a really amazing theme. So this is just an example of one of the many third-party developers who creates content for uh, themes for Rapid Weaver, which are very easily modifiable. And so uh, I I found this one. I just fell in love with it. Okay, so that's the basic create theme. And here's what I did with it. Okay, I didn't change too much of the create theme, actually. I changed the background. I changed the CSS coding so that I could have this pale blue in the background. I took out all of the um, box that and the shadowing and the other effects that surrounded the navigation menu. So if you go back to the original, you see it's got this box around the navigation menu with this line and this um, text shadowing and I just didn't want that so I took it out and the other great thing I found with um, this theme is again different header image on every page different content in the sidebar from page to page and um, I took out the sidebar on a couple of the pages. On the portfolio page of my cookies website, um, I inserted this slideshow. So instead of flash, I'm just giving people an opportunity to look at the pictures at their own pace and click on them to get to the next one. Or you can go back. It's really wonderful. Okay. And I also link to my blog which was built on a WordPress platform. And like I said, I'll talk about that in another video, but I did change the background of this blog to match my website and everything links up. So that's how I design a website using Rapid Weaver. If you're interested in talking about your website with me, please drop me a line at mari at mischiefmari.com. Thanks for watching and I hope to hear from you soon.